so we see the url okay go to this url so this is the demo of my phone welcome back uh, and here you see that we have the title the note content and you can create the note here and also in the bottom if you see there was a add it note okay we'll see that later so here what we are doing is here we are typing a new note again the same way the new content and we are going to create the note here okay so yes the note has been created again we're creating another note and so on okay that's done so to delete a note we, we just gave that x button and it got deleted again we're deleting another note again it is deleted all right so here i clicked on add this ticket to my home screen which was there in the bottom so you see that it is adding that to our uh, mobile what you can actually infer here is we are actually installing this application on our phone okay so this is not actually an application it's a web app progressive web app so we have installed the progressive web app and it now looks like an app you can see that we have an icon for that app we have a name you can uninstall it again so on if I go to the app info, you see that the storage used by it is very, very low. It is only 235 kilobytes. That is super low for an application. All right. And now let's close this. Let's go to the application which we built. Let's close all other apps. Let's go to the application. Yeah, we have this ticket. You saw the the splash screen. It's, it shows up. Okay, you can choose the color uh, and the text which is going to appear there. And here we are again, we are typing in the app itself this time. It is not the website. So we are typing in the app. So it is saving it there. All right. So let's try offline. All right. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn my Wi-Fi off. All right. And then close the app. reopen it we see that the the notes are there okay now let's try adding a new note and by the way again reminding you this is offline all right we don't have the wi-fi there and once we create note it gets created amazingly and again we're going to create some more notes that also works if you can close the app and open it any number of times you need not reconnect to the internet it would still work you can delete the notes so on so on so all of the complete functionality is available offline also this is the magic of pwa and i'm going to show you exactly how we can build this entire project okay we're going to build from scratch don't worry there are no prerequisites here okay just don't worry whatever is needed here i'm going to show you the only prerequisite which might help you is html and css and don't worry about that you can contact me about that i have free uh, free videos available on my youtube also the courses are available on udemy you can check them out and reach out to me all right so let's proceed with this and in the next video onwards we're gonna start learning javascript dom and uh, finally we'll end up doing this amazing project each and every step and the entire code of this project is also open sourced on github uh, i'm sure you would have got the link of it by now you can go check it out you can try running it or make modifications if you already know or just wait for me until i teach them and you will be ready to go so all right see you inside the course i'm super excited see you inside